and there was a terrible storm. It wasn't that Jesus was not in the boat. It was not whether they seen or maybe they neglected Jesus. Jesus was there, but the boat was very rocky. Rocky to the extent that they were telling him, don't you even care if we die? Uh, there were times like that in my life. I said, God, don't you even care about what is going on in my life? Um, I want to appreciate somebody that was here. I didn't know he was going to come because the wife called me and said she would not be able to come. But she didn't tell me her husband was going to come. So uh, that is uh, one part I don't know. But I want to appreciate Brother Jai or Ketayo. Um, <laughs> if I give you a pen and paper, I can write a little bit about my, my life. Okay. Uh, we were together as teenagers. We were together as a professionals in UCH, and uh, I think we were, we were also together through the marriage, through the rocky, through the storm, through everything, they saw it all. Uh, but I want to thank God. I want to appreciate God. I also want to appreciate the man of God, who did not respond to my text that he was coming, uh, which is a little endangla. Somebody like that, you don't get him just like that. But and that's why I said I enjoy Ori of him. And it is that holy of faith that I'm going to enjoy. And I want to appreciate God in the life of uh, Bishop Abiola. May the Lord bless you. Uh, I give you a little bit about the journey too. And uh, we have been coming, right, from a long time ago. Uh, before the Lord took us to where, where we are today, we were there, right, my brother? Uh, the Lord is good. Uh, the boat was really rocky. It was rocky, but when you know the person, who is anchoring the boat? You will not have any cause to Is there anything that can really be easy? 
that you can just grab like that. And yet, when people look at me, it's as if I have it all. But I have it all because I have the Lord Jesus Christ. And I don't put myself in a way that people can be sorry for me because there is nothing to be sorry about. But one thing I will say, when people see me walking for God and they are worrying, worrying about me, uh, I was talking about that about two weeks ago to somebody. I said, nobody needs to pity me when I'm working for God. There's another woman of God I want to acknowledge. Uh, my sister was saying amen. That amen is for me to let her know not to forget her. We <laughs> 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 have been there. We have been there. Johnny, we have been there. She's a, a true friend. And she is somebody who really understands me very understand well. Um, and I said, don't say that. Because where we used to live at uh, Rife is called Opa. Uh, we built the house there. There was nobody around there. And we were even the one who went to the post. They are the one who used to Opa or Mumichi today. Those were the two poles that I put here. Uh, and all of a sudden, there was this so much suffering. Children were having poor shovel in my hand. The husband was a doctor. I was a nurse. Although I had to give up my job because he misbehaved that job and they were going to lay him off and I had to stand in and say that I was one who owned what he did and that he did it for me. So, and it was the time when there was embargo. It was this boy that was there. And on the day I went, there was embargo. And my family turned against me. How could you do that to yourself? How could you lose your job? All of a sudden, I became a gardener. I had to farm. I had to go and buy an so that another male egg will be a male cock will be able to do that so that I can use the egg to fry something using open oil. And one day my mother came and stumbled on me doing that. My mother said, if I knew you can do that like this, I wouldn't even have bothered to send you to school. <laughs> because I didn't want to go to her to let her know what, was, what I was going through. Because I was born who saw this man and married to nobody. If somebody had given him to me, I would have gone to the person and locked the person that day and say, Yeah, you can hear. And that kind of thing. He's a wonderful man. But for a strange thing, it's like all of a sudden, we just didn't click. And we went on like that for 24 years. He's still a good man. He's still a very good man. Okay? So I'm not saying he's a bad man, but I mean, sometimes the whole, this thing doesn't don't work. And I, I suffered so much. And I remember one day. I stood under the orange tree in my compound and I looked up and I 